Two tropical storms have been headed towards the Gulf Coast on Monday. Marco and Laura may hit just some hundred miles aside inside 48 hours of one another. Forecasters imagine Laura might be a serious hurricane when it makes landfall, and residents in low-lying areas have been ordered to evacuate. Marco is predicted to hit the Louisiana coast by Monday. The storm had strengthened to a hurricane Sunday however has since weakened to a tropical storm. As of 2 p.m. ET, Marco was positioned about 40 miles southeast of the mouth of the Mississippi River with most sustained winds of 40 miles per hour, and it was heading northwest at 6 miles per hour, based on the nationwide hurricane middle. In the meantime, Laura, which battered the Dominican Republic and Haiti, leaving thousands and thousands without energy and killing not less than 11, is predicted to hit the U.S. by Wednesday night or Thursday. Forecasters count on the storm to carry widespread flooding and life-threatening storm surge. The storms have been heading for the U.S. forward of the 15th anniversary of Hurricane Katrina devastating New Orleans. Louisiana Governor John Bell Edwards stated the window between the two storms might be as slim as 12 hours, and it comes amid the coronavirus pandemic, an added problem as individuals depart their properties and head to shelters. Laura was not anticipated to weaken over land earlier than shifting into heat, deep gulf waters that forecasters stated may carry speedy intensification. We're solely going to dodge the bullet so many occasions. And the present forecast for Laura has it targeted intently on Louisiana, Edwards stated throughout a information briefing. Shrimp trawlers and fishing boats have been tied up in a Louisiana harbor forward of the storms. Crimson flags warn swimmers away from the pounding surf. Each in-person lessons and digital faculty periods required due to the pandemic have been cancelled in some districts. A meals financial institution that has been twice as busy as regular since March offering meals to individuals affected by the pandemic ready to close down for a couple of days due to the climate, however not earlier than distributing a final spherical of provisions to the needy. We're very drained, stated Lawrence Dehart, director of Tereboni Church Building's United Food Bank in Homa. State emergencies have been declared in Louisiana and Mississippi, and shelters have been being opened with cots set farther aside, amongst different measures designed to curb infections. The virus is just not involved that we have now hurricanes coming, and so it isn't going to take any day without work and neither can we, Edwards stated. A number of hours away from the Louisiana coast, a lopsided Marco continued to break down. By late Monday morning, meteorologists may now not discover tropical storm force winds inside its ragged heart. It stayed a tropical storm solely due to stronger winds to the northeast. Due to that, the nationwide hurricane middle cancelled some tropical storm warnings however saved them for the New Orleans area and farther east to the Mississippi and Alabama border, the place Marco nonetheless had a little bit of power. The specter of two to four toes of storm surge remained. Hampered by robust crosswinds that have been decapitating the storm, Marco was anticipated to lose tropical storm designation late Monday, the hurricane heart stated. Whereas Marco weakened, Laura's potential bought stronger, and forecasters raised the potential of a serious hurricane that might pummel western Louisiana and Jap Texas from late Wednesday into Thursday. As soon as Laura passes Cuba, the system may shortly strengthen over heat water, which acts as gas to supercharge the storm. Forecasters predicted winds of 105 miles per hour earlier than landfall, however some fashions confirmed a good stronger storm.